to wash my hair. I know y'all haven't really seen the hair, but I'm about to wash this hair. Look at that. I don't know what I'm about to do too. I don't know if I'm gonna braid it back. If I do, I'm gonna have to take off these nails. But if I braid it back, then I can just throw the wig back on or I can get a style. I have no idea what I'm gonna do. I don't know. But I think I might give the, the set it off braids a chill pill and maybe just do a, a style to my hair. Something a protective style because I'm not leaving my hair out. I said this year I'm not gonna leave my hair out. I'm not gonna put no heat in it and I'm not gonna dye it. That's on my roots. My roots. That's like two inches and it's not two inches, one and a half. So I'm trying. I'm trying to put my hair back up to how it was. It was a little bit well, it was definitely longer than this when I first went natural. Um I never went back to relax my hair, but I was putting heat in my hair and I cut it and then I was dying it, bleaching. Like of course, red, you have to bleach. Then put that red pigment in there. So you're doing a double process when you're here when you're dyeing it something that's not a natural um, color and to make it come out vibrant. Cause it's even more vibrant. Cause this is dull. This is hair that hasn't been dyed in a minute, as you can see. Some of the blonde, you know. Cause it's just holding on to the hair. So this is the red that has actually held on. Cause usually if I, you know, we're trying to keep the red hair, you have to wash it in cold water cause hot water will get that baby out. Red hair is just hot maintenance as everybody knows. And I love the red hair on me. So I don't know if I'm ready to just go back to black, but I don't think I'm gonna dye my hair red anytime soon. And if it is, it'll be something where I'll still have some black. Maybe I might put like highlights, like little highlights and then have it fade to the rest of this red. But me full out bleaching and putting the red on, I'm not gonna do that at this time. I need my hair to grow out and be healthy. So all this black is virgin hair. I mean, no heat, no dye. No nothing. That's that's what they mean by virgin hair. No heat, no nothing, no chemicals. Straight out the scalp baby. That's how I came. So, and this is like you say the dead part. The red is like the dead part. So yeah, I'm not gonna do no crazy cut out the red or try to strip the red. I don't even feel like doing all that. I just wanted to fade away. And I'll just cut it off little by little. But I'll cut off the parts where it's, um, it's straight. Cause some of my ends are sh like, this is good in the back. But some in the front where I put the heat at, my curl is a little loose cause I was putting heat on it. So I'm trying to get my curl back, okay? All right, let me wash my hair cause I'm supposed to be uh, working. And since we don't got that much work to do, I said, let me just wash my hair real quick. Instead of waiting for the weekend. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'll come back um, with it conditioned or well, with the conditioner sitting in it and me detangling it. You can see it when it's wet. All right. See you on the next clip.
that's the hair. See, it wasn't that much, but obviously it's the straggle pieces because they're sh freaking straight. Some of them got a little bit of a curl, but the most of it is straight. So that's it. That's all it was. <clears throat> okay, y'all. This is the Huini's product. Look at my curls. It just makes such a difference when you cut off those little ends. All I did was I put some leave-in conditioner. Um, and so what is that from Cancer? Put some of this in, like not that much. Maybe I should turn it around. Ta I put a little bit in the hydrant and repair shampoo. This is it. I got this off of Amazon. It works really good. And it's the same thing, the matching conditioner. It says hydrate and restore extreme dry, brittle hair. As you can see, <laughs> I'm gonna need some more. And what I usually use, cause when I was going to the hair salon and I would get my hair done, this is what the girl used on my hair. I got this also from Amazon too. It's the Rickin All Soft. That's what I was saying, so soft, but it's called All Soft. The conditioner is bomb. Um, I don't have that much and the conditioner is all gone. That's why I ordered these because this little bottle, it's expensive anyway, like you can get this from Target, but this little bottle with the conditioner was like $30. I was like, come on. And usually it's 20, but it went to 30. I'm like, so that's why I ordered the Shea um, Moisture Shampoo and Conditioner. So I want to try that out just so I can have, you know, options. I like them both, so I will buy either one of them. If either one of them out of stock, I'm buying the other one. And the red can has leave-in conditioner. I don't have that bottle because I literally had to cut it in half to get the rest of the leave-in conditioner out, okay? But the, also the leave-in conditioner that I like to use before before I ran out of, before I got that one was, um, I think it's by Aunt Jackie. Aunt Jackie, and I don't know the name of it, but that was wonderful and it smelled so good. So I have to get some more of all that stuff, some more conditioner and some more Aunt Jackie and some more leave-in conditioner. So, that was it. And I showed you the little pomade I used. I didn't use anything else in my hair. And it's semi-dry. It's a little wet, but it's semi-dry. And that was it, and that's all. That's it. That's all I use. All right. I'm gonna do something to it where it won't get tangled. And Till further notice, I guess. Till further notice. Okay, here she is. No, I'm not dread locking my hair. I just want to twist it. So I can do a twist out and it'll be even more fluffy and big and more defined. But I'm not that chick to be waiting for these to get some dreads and wait for them to grow out. That's not me. I can't do it, sis. I don't, I don't like short hair on me at all. I don't, I just don't. I don't like short hair. But these twists came out good. They're more defined that I cut off these. They're more defined now that I cut off the straggles. They was holding me back, baby. But no, just wanted to show you guys what it was before. I unraveled it. I'll probably keep this in for the rest of the day because, I mean, I'm not going anywhere. So I'll probably keep it in. Okay. That's me, that's she. Next time I come back, I'll probably put a little bedazzle on with this fluffed out. But those are my twists. Hey. Hi guys. So this is the final look. I put a little makeup on. Spruce it up. This is the final look. I'm terrible at just holding the camera. It's my natural. And this is a day later. Is it a day later or two days later? I don't know. But yes. Natural curls, I'm probably leave this my hair like this for a week and then braid it back up. So I can put my wig on. But 
yes i hope you enjoyed this video i told you i'm about to push out content baby content okay so i hope you enjoyed this video and you stay tuned for the next one all right